also up to him. I was, but now I got it. <laughs> got your camera. Give me the camera. You owe me 10 push ups. <sighs> <laughs> if I could even do push-ups. Good afternoon. What is going on, everybody? I am headed over to the offices, five percent offices. I got some, uh, I got some supplements. I gotta go get. I gotta go talk to a couple people. Gotta see what they're doing. It's always a good time going in there. Yeah. Ugh. It's always a good time to go over to the office and see everybody over there. All the smiles. Anyway, so. Let's see here. I don't, I'm not even really counting the days all that well. Had my surgery on the 27th of last month. It's now May 4th. Here, to get this damn thing off. Yes, I put it on literally just to go in the warehouse. Because, ouch. Oh, all right. Yeah, I put it on just to go in the warehouse. Because, well, there's a lady in there named Selma that, like, gives me things. And a little bit about Selma. Selma likes hockey. You guys have seen Selma on the channel before, but Selma likes hockey. What I know about women who like hockey, they all like violence. And I know Selma, and she definitely likes violence. So she would have whooped my ass and I would have had to go get my other shoulder worked on again if I went in there without wearing my sling. She watches my stories and she sees what I'm doing. So if I would have went in there slingless, I would have walked out needing another sling, I guarantee you. So, I don't want that smoke. And I just don't have the energy. Anyway, so I got a ton of er other errands to run. This is just like a wonderful day in the life of Coach Mayhem. Y'all think I just like hang out on the beach all day and smoke blunts and chill out with the dog or whatever? No, 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 I work like a, a lot. You just happen to see and I happen to take my camera when I'm out doing absolutely nothing, having fun, having a good time, enjoying the fruits of my labor because I work all the damn time. But nope, 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 nope. And then I don't want to record me just working all day because y'all want to just see me like, how about I just do a time lapse of my day where I'm just sitting at my computer for 12 hours, just and then getting up, pacing around, losing my mind, screaming at the screen. Cause that's pretty much what the day's like. Either way, got a couple things I needed from them. God love them for that. If you guys need bodybuilding supplements, you already know where to go. Head over 5percentnutrition.com. Bodybuilding supplements, not the bullshit. It's real easy. That was easy enough. Now I just gotta go, now that I dropped those old brake pads off, I gotta get new brake pads for this damn car. Cause the old ones didn't have the sensor in it. So, instead of my car yelling at me, telling me I need to replace the damn brake pads, I'm gonna go order the right ones. Day in the life, right? Good times. So, on my way over to Tampa, we're gonna go see this doctor, see the orthopedic doctor, see what he's talking about with my shoulder, go check out some images. Hopefully they're looking good, they're feeling better, so, All right, so we are over here at the orthopedic doc over in St. Pete. So I'm gonna go over in here, see what they got to say. Hopefully it's good news and I will be right back. All right, well, um, apparently I really did a number on my shoulder uh, over the years or sometime in between. Somehow my shoulder is dislocating like a lot. I got these cool scopes. Like I'm gonna have to post these things don't make a whole lot of sense to me because it's like the inside of the body so I'm not gonna be able to sit here and re-explain it all I know is like that was a giant piece of cartilage that was supposed to be attached to my shoulder somewhere it's not attached to my shoulder somewhere so apparently my shoulder has been dislocating a lot and caused all sorts of issues in there uh, doc it was even like man you, you really did it to this this one so um, yeah, I was gonna be Mr. Badass and like not uh not wear this sling, but with the information I just got, I think I may, might play it a little bit more on the safe side. Thank God that I have some of the best care from like Titan Medical, the doctors here, and everything because yeah, like the information that they just told me, I'm a little bit worried about my shoulder. I'm missing cartilage in places. 
ball joint of my shoulder is actually cracked from where I dislocated and slammed back into whatever really hard. So, um, yeah, man, I wasn't really expecting this type of bullshit. So, well, we're still going to get after it. Fuck it. Let's go. As, as you guys know, if you've been following me for any amount of time on my social media or here on YouTube, you would know that I've been hurt for the better part of this year because I was hit in my on my motorcycle coming back. Well, well I shouldn't even say coming back. I was hit on my motorcycle after we came back from the Arnold last year in March. So I've been pretty much hurt since then where I was supposed to be getting bigger and gaining weight. Nope, I am in the hospital and just trying to stay healthy. On top of that, I've also been fighting with this ulcer that has been nothing but absolute problems for me. So, it's been just a miracle that I've been able to just maintain my size in any way, shape, form, or fashion. But you guys know me, that's not good enough for me. I always want the best and I always want to get better. So, goal is to gain 20 pounds by the brand new year. Now, I'm not talking just 20 pounds sloppy, none of that. I'm talking 20 pounds, we're still lean, we're still photo shoot ready, and I gotta do it inside of five months, four months, give or take. Because I have that surgery in there as well. And then plus, I think we're going to the Olympia this year. I'm not exactly sure, it's still too far out to tell. I would assume that we're going given the fact that it's in Orlando, but hey, who knows? Either way, I will be uh, keeping you guys up to date with that and how that goal is going. Oh, and this is a nerve wracking one because if I fuck up, I fuck up in front of all of you guys. So I'd rather not look like an asshole. I'd rather hit these goals. So that adds a whole new level of pressure to this goal. Oh, on top of all the courses and shit that I'm already in, learning all type of good stuff about the crypto market, you name it, because I like to make money online get a lot of you guys asking how I make money online. I don't have the time to teach you, but if you guys look down in the link in my description, you go to the real world, they would be more than happy to help you learn all different types of ways to learn money online. There's 19 different ways you are gonna learn from certified millionaire professors who are making money every day in this. And let me tell you, I wish I had this resource five years ago when I started working for myself because I'd be light years away from where I am now. Either way. so. Enough of that, we're gonna gain 20 pounds, we're gonna get this surgery done and over with, we're gonna recover just as Wolverine, just like I always do, and that's